Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be playing on the TTS as the new season Solar Raid is about to release. It's currently on PC for playtesting on the technical test server. We're going to be playing it today, and I'm going to give you guys my first impressions on the new season Operation Solar Raid, as well as the new defender, Solus, who has the these like augmented reality glasses that she can see through walls um to detect attacker gadgets so the device the uh specific description is device that identifies opponent electronic devices then scans them to ping their locations so basically what they're telling you is solus is pulse but instead of detecting heartbeats it detects electronics like iq's uh phone gadget so think of it as that but you're wearing it in goggle form so aside from that we've also got a lot of very new cool things there's a new map called night haven labs that just got released i believe it's going to be added into the ranked pool and you're not going to be able to ban it and going forward you'll never be able to ban the new map so i am actually looking forward to that there's also going to be crossplay between xbox and playstation meaning if you're on xbox you can now play with and against people who are on playstation and there's going to be cross progression between all platforms which is something that people have been asking for for years and years and years but finally if you have an xbox account and you want to bring all of the stuff from your xbox account and put it on your pc account for example you're going to be able to do that with the new cross progression so thank goodness they finally added that in there's also a ton of new quality life things rank 2.0 there's going to be new um drone skins etc there's a new battle pass they're actually even talking about new anti-cheat solutions but they haven't really talked specifics on that just yet but yeah as you can see here with the new season a year seven season four they're going to be taking favela out of ranked and adding in night haven labs i'm very excited about that there's also going to be new ranked rewards as you guys can see right here there's going to be as well five ranks in each rank with the addition of emerald it's a brand new rank in siege and as you guys can see underneath each rank there are more rank rewards so you're going to unlock a champ background if you hit champ you're going to unlock an alpha pack that says champions i don't really know what that means there's diamond alpha packs champion alpha packs who knows even what that means just yet but you're also going to get your traditional charm which i think looks pretty darn good they also changed around the speeds of some operators now so my beloved osa is going to be moving down from a 2-2 to a one speed osa is now a one speed and they're doing this for a lot of operators it's not just osa it's also operators like mute he's going to be a one speed now you're trying to run them run around the map think about it you have four jammers to place and you have to make rotates and you have to run around as a one speed to do it i feel sorry for anybody who has to play mute and comp now but they're doing it for a lot of operators i believe sledge also got reduced to a one speed as well this one i'm not sure if i agree with i think the osa one has some definite uh possibilities to be a buff which we'll get into later but i think this sledge one man him being a one speed i'm not sure that fits his play style bro he's got a hammer he's supposed to be the guy that breaches the door he goes in first he's aggressive and you put him to a one speed ah uh, i don't get it personally let me know what you guys think about these changes down below in the comments we're gonna hop in to some gameplay here so i show you exactly what i mean if you guys enjoy this video consider liking subscribe if you're new and check out the black friday buy one get one free g fuel sale the links is down below in the description or on the pinned comment you guys should seriously check this out i'll put a little graphic on screen right now of exactly what you're getting but this is a very exclusive sale that's going on only for a couple days and some of these g fuel flavors are only going to be available for a day two days so do not wait check out the links down below in the description and feel free to check out that black friday buy one get one free g fuel sale and anyways let's move on straight into some gameplay Ooh, the renegades look really cool when they're blue i'm not gonna lie i almost want to keep it like that i like that a lot i don't know what do you guys think does it look does it look good as blue i think it does i'm also running around as meat right now as a one speed this is um interesting to say the least All right, that's Therm. Coming in above us. Oh, this is sketchy, bro. One op four remaining. Nice. Where's he 
at? Over there? Wow, he's really far away from us. What? It's gonna take me forever to get there as a one speed. God dang it, Ubisoft. Why are they making me a one speed out here, bro? I don't know how to get there, this map. This map is so confusing right now. All right, we're upstairs, but I don't know where he's at anymore. I hear him shotgunning. Oh, he's right here. Oh, you got smoked. Can you imagine, ladies and gentlemen, if this was you? Bro, I smoked this dude and he goes, is that the real shock? <laughs> I love playing the TTS. I don't think you can do streamer mode names. So like you're just locked to whatever you play name is. So every time I play the TTS, everybody goes, is that the real shock? I don't know. It's kind of funny. All right, let's see where, where are these drones? I've already shot one. Hey, there's one. Can we shoot this to the floor? No, it's outside. It looks like. Ooh, this one, if it's the same, it stands still. I might try to shoot through the floor. No. Damn, I just want to shoot one of them through the floor, bro. All right, so I want to see what happens when it runs out of juice. Oh, it just shuts off. All right, that's about what I figured. I didn't know if it would like stay up and give you an error or something, but it just, it just goes off. About what I figured, and it's on a recharge, so looks like you just have to wait for a little bit. All right, we're gonna hold this angle, and we might get a kill. Anyone joining us? <laughs> no, we look good. SMG 11 time. Last operator standing. I don't see anyone else. I think we're good now. There we go. All right, he's downstairs. I actually know where he is. I think. Let's see, he's not droning. I think he's right down here and to my right. Problem is I just can't see anything. What is this guy doing? I was like playing with him a little bit, but now he's just leaving. Oh, and now I'm whiffing. Oh my God, my hand locked up. Hey, I'm sorry about this guys. This is embarrassing. I'm, I'm embarrassed to put my name on that kill cam. Anyways, that was a lot of fun. I love that. I actually love uh, the new operators kit because you've got the PDW, which is just unbelievably fun to play with. And then you also have the SMG 11. And I feel like not enough operators have the SMG 11 now. They took it away from Sledge. Didn't even give it to anybody. Amaru sucks to play. On defense, you've got Smoke and Mute, but they just made Mute a one speed. So I don't know. I feel like... The new operator is a huge dub so far. That was a ton of fun. All right, here we go. I got this sledge, don't worry about it, bro. The two one speeds now moving in together. Hopefully, yeah, hopefully, I hope he was pushing with me at least. Camera. Clearing the maps like this is just so slow now. But that extra health is nice, so. You know, how much can you really complain? I do want to find a staircase though. Here's a hatch. Let's open the hatch. Yo, flood. Okay, never mind. There's a guy over here anyways. He's dead, I think. Nice. That guy was really just sitting right there. Oh, I hate this room. This room in particular is so open to so many angles. I don't even want to try to push that. I wish sludge had opened that, but I guess thermite's got it. Blue exothermic charge. Kind of cool. All right, what am I looking at? Let's drone. Probably the best thing we could do right now. I don't know where I'm at. Oh, I see one. We could probably just drop and kill that guy. Wait, where am I looking at? Totally forgot where I was looking at. I'm like stuck on my teammates. 
Alright, I'm pulling out the shield, bro. I'm worried. I'm scared. I don't see anybody else though. This is my problem with this map so far is I keep seeing like just like one person and then I can't find anybody else for like the longest time. I don't I really don't think it's the map's fault. I think it's just everyone's walking around trying to do the same thing, just trying to find each other. But I think the map is big enough to where it's kind of hard to do that. That was ahead. Uh, to be honest, bro, to be 100% honest with you, I thought that was a my show cam. It sounds goofy, but her head looks like a my show cam. Dude, this guy's straight up a terminator. He just he, he just goes prone and then every time he hears a noise, he stands up and just destroys it. Uh oh. Top four last stop standing. Looks like a GG to me. Down to one friendly. Unless the Terminator clutches up. Don't kill the hostage. GG. Top four. Hey, we got that flawless victory. Here's the new uh like background screen for when you play the new map. I think it looks pretty cool. So far the map, I'm gonna rate it like a, a six out of 10 so far. All right, so another change is there's no more friendly fire in the prep phase, as you can see. As soon as the action phase starts up again though, the friendly fire will be reinitiated. But I think this is really cool. I really do like this change. It means you can make rotates, blow up your teammates, do whatever you need to do and uh you won't have any sort of 4v5s going into the action phase which i think is great listen we're against pro player easily right now and he's smoking our pack he says he's a big fan though so i i guess it's i guess it's okay but to be honest i don't like getting smoked around like this i i, I don't really like it oh no i think they're walking in sight i don't know how to get back to sight though i don't have the bailiff for the hatch either oh no where am i it's a maze. I'm in a maze. Pause. Take out the hostile. All right, well, that's Ash. Dude, where am I? All right, kitchen window. I'm sorry. I'm starting to learn. Let me dock. Let me dock. There we go. Oh, is that wall open? They've ceased attempting to secure the container. That's one. I gotta heal up. Oh boy. Oh boy. Securing the container. He's running. Where'd this guy go, bro? Should I just hop out? Nah. He's dead. <laughs> Alright. All right, easily is voicing his concerns for this map being added into ranked this next season without it being bannable. So I'm not sure if I went over this earlier, but the new maps uh, going forward, you'll no longer be able to ban them. But let me know what you guys think about that in the comments. Is that a good thing? Is it a bad thing? When you're trying to play in a competitive environment and you're playing for ELO, you're playing competitively, should you have something that could compromise that competitive integrity? Should you have a map that is possibly not competitively viable? but you're forced to play it. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I'm not sure. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. I really have no take on it either way. I don't play competitively. I don't really care for ranks either way, but you guys definitely need to let me know. All right, I'm gonna use this gadget. I heard someone get on cam. I don't see him though. He must've got off. I'm getting pushed from a lot of different directions right now. I don't see anyone on camps though, so no one's droning me out. Oh, okay, someone's on cam. Wait, I saw something over here. Yep, I saw him get on cam right there. Okay. I wonder if I jump out here, if I can see this guy. Go too slow. Okay. One more. Let's see if we can get him on cams. I saw something over there. I can't vault. You have been spotted by I gotta get back inside. I'm trying to I'm trying to do that to a pro player right now. That, that's literally a pro player out there, and I'm trying to BM him like that. Oh! Nada did it. Let's go. Alright. Damn, damn.
all right so we're back on attack let's pick up sledge this time because like i said they they made my man sledge a one speed and i'm just not sure if it's a good thing or a bad thing yet in my mind it's a bad thing i just i feel so bad for sledge bro first they take away his acog then they take away his smg 11 then they take away his two speed like bro come on man all right here we go one speed sledge Ugh. it just doesn't feel right guys i'm sorry it just doesn't i'm so used to playing two speeds it just doesn't feel right to me i'm so used to two speeds and three speeds dude i just have no idea where i am i just be like walking around the map forever and i'm a one speed so it takes so long i'm just trying to find how to get inside oh oh that's terrible who did that who's responsible bro where even is sight guys Bye, i've been yeah, running look at the time looking. left i've been running around this whole time i'm just trying to figure out where where to go dude oh boy Can we just drop can i just nade and drop i'm fighting the dock you're on the breach bro damn i really ran around that whole time not to see anybody bro well knock shotty for you ladies and gentlemen it's still good even in the tts this guy thinks I'm like the fake shock or something, so I just blew his mind, bro. <laughs> he's been he's been in the chat the whole time, like fake shock or whatever. I he, I just blew his mind right there. Apparently, I'm I just got canceled, I guess, for clipping him. I didn't really consider it a clip. I'm just kind of recording like the whole video, so he's going in anyways. But unfortunate, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> wrong place, wrong time. That's one guy. I heard him up there. Countering that intel. I'll just hop in here. Wait, there is a guy in here. Wait, what? I'm so confused. I'm not even sure where that guy came from. This guy says, Osa nerf shock. How are you feeling? Well, Going dark. I think I've already said how I'm feeling. Um, I think it could be a buff just because you take more, you can take more shots now to the arms and the legs when you're holding your shield. You're a moving tank. I don't know if it's a nerf, but I do think the sledge thing is a nerf. I think the sledge change is bad, and I think the mute change is bad. But that's just me. Oh, uh, check out this spawn, bro. This spawn's cool. I think this map looks great, man. I'm so glad the map is so bright. It looks it looks really cool. I think this ship looks awesome too. Can you go inside of it? That'd be cool. Hold up, can you? No! Come on, Ubisoft. I'm coming, I'm coming. What do we got going on here? So it should be here. Yeah, I hear him. I hear him. Yep, he dropped. He dropped. All right, so he should be below us now. And I think one of the bomb sites is actually here. Hold on. All right, it's like a million ways he could have like left. This is bad. You have located a bomb. So they're in the basement. I don't know how to get below us though. I'd imagine there's a hatch that we could maybe get, but oh boy. Oh, I found a staircase. Here we go. I move so slow though. This is a, this is like awful, bro. Like I'm all for the more HP. 
I think it's probably like a net good thing, but damn, this speed is terrible. I feel like an old man. Nice. All right. I uh, don't really know where I'm looking. Get the shield out. You have dropped the diffuser. Oh boy. The other one was here too. One friendly. What? This guy! Yo, where did this guy come from? I knew he was like in this area, but like what? Oh, if I if I had known that he was right there. Damn. Heartbreaking defeat. That sucks.